We begin tonight with new information on a deadly plane crash. A small aircraft went down near the Newport News Williamsburg International Airport, and this comes as a local university releases a statement about two of their students involved in an accident. Tonight, News 3 reporter Leandra Head joining us live from the scene of the crash. So Leandra, what more can you tell us? Well, Kurt, I can tell you that a total of three people were on that plane, according to Virginia State Police. Police also telling us that the pilot of that plane has died. Now, Hampton University releasing a statement and telling us that two of their students were involved in an unfortunate accident. We're working to learn the identities of the people who were on that plane. So far, police have not yet released any identities of anyone on that plane. Airplane that went into a tree. A plane crashed at the Newport News Williamsburg International Airport. It was a small aircraft, a Cessna. The flight originated at the same airport. Subject with a concussion, subject with a broken arm and a broken leg. Police say the pilot died in the crash. The co pilot and the passenger were sent to the hospital in critical condition. The two that are critically injured um, are at Riverside um, Regional Hospital at this time, and we are still investigating. We're trying to make notification for the deceased of the family. Police say the two people that were sent to the hospital in critical condition are both 18-year-old males from Maryland. Officials say the pilot who died was a woman, her age unknown at this time. Say police sent us these pictures of the plane after it crashed into a ditch. Now we just received confirmation from Hampton University saying that two of their students were involved in today's plane crash. The cause of that crash is unknown at this time. As we learn more on this crash, stay with News 3. Live in Newport News, Leandra Head, News 3.